What's up gamester? Easy Fred is here once again and I will be your game guide for today. If you subscribe to my channel, you're gonna get my first impressions, reviews, and tutorials on the latest and top mobile games today. I upload videos on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, PhD, so stay tuned, sit back, watch this video up until the end, and don't forget to take it easy. Alright, so for today we have another interesting topic and that is how you can finish all your dungeon quests much faster. Right, because as you know, this is time consuming gamester because you're gonna need a party in order for you to do it. So we're gonna do that right here right now so that you can save some time doing your dungeon quest. Alright, so without further ado, Let's go ahead into the game. Alright, so game story, the first thing that uh, you have to do is, of course, be the party leader. Go for the lowest one, which is Scarlet Old Town. Tell. As long as the recommended EP is met and you can finish the dungeon, go ahead and do it. So you create. You'll be the one to create. Alright. And then... You just need to recruit members, of course, but when you recruit members, make sure to include this message. So, all, make it all caps so everyone can see. All run, don't leave. Alright. So, enter and then all run, don't leave, or anything that would let other people know that you're gonna do all the dungeon quests. So that they will stay on a party, okay? And then send out your message. So all we have to do now is wait for members. So we have currently we we have uh, two members right now. So it's 9:44 a.m. server time. All right, and we just need two more. We need two more members to join our team. So hopefully this party that we can get will stick to our party so two more please two more members so it's 9 44 a.m. and actually this is the, the part where it will consume a bit of your time because of the members you're trying to recruit members so it's the earlier the better server time usually recess at around 6 a.m. or reach the server time so as long as as early as that from 6 a.m. up until 9 or 10 that will be the perfect time for you to do your dungeon quest and party quest i'm not quite sure if there's a lot of people doing that uh around uh, afternoon or noon time or evening but uh what i found out is uh, there's a lot of people doing it as early as the server reset time so we just need one more member come on gamester the good thing about it is if you do party quest you're gonna have a higher exp rate so we're now we're complete let's go so that nobody get a chance to leave the party so who is not here rndc where are you okay there you go so carlet old town hopefully this party sticks in 9 45 we so we spend like one minute searching for the party all right there you go so 9 46 to be exact the server time guys 9 46 so we started with carlet old town even this is just a low level dungeon it was this will still give you exp <laughs> all right and that's the good part of it where are my party members so make sure that you go to the party uh, window so that you can see if everyone is there but so dungeons like this uh, usually have uh three attempts or three three trials so you need to finish all of those so that you can get the exp the items is already low level but if you're still level 40 or something yeah you can still make use of these items but the items are level 40 so if you're like the same as my level level 70 so then this will not be helpful for you then just click on challenge again so that it will reset the dungeon oh it's complete already so we have to leave it because we already completed 3, 0, 3, loot count 0, 3 so you can leave the dungeon. Then you move on to the next dungeon right now. This is pretty simple stuff guys so this is definitely for newbies. So if you've been playing this game for a while now, if you have other tips and suggestions that uh, can help our newbies much better, then yeah, please share it on the comment section down below.
setting and then let's go we're still complete let's go stone abyss stone gate abyss let's go awaiting confirmation that's all good all right you can start anyway but not if somebody cancel it okay because you're gonna be incomplete hopefully one of our party member will be there so let's check it out so it's Polvia. so Polvia is still here so the reason why it's still waiting confirmation probably Polvia was still loading on the loading screen while we are trying to enter the dungeon already so that's all good as long as Polvia did not cancel or one of your party member did not cancel it okay so that's all good you will still be complete and uh, they can still catch up inside you can just skip this part because you've been watching it almost every day right so just skip it as you can see guys there's a lot of people who's really searching for all runs so this is really very effective you can complete almost all of your party quest or almost all of the quest that requires party as long as this team stays intact well if your guild is uh, promoting it then go for your guildmate first of course right but i'm showing it to you that even if you don't have guild even if you just go outside and just send a recruit you can still do this okay this is very effective for you to finish all of your quests dungeon quests and party quests so that you have all of your other time to do your single quest and upgrade your items and improve your ep which I've already discussed on my previous video, so if you haven't watched my previous videos yet on how to increase your EP, how to fix your skills, alright, I'll go ahead and include a link on the description down below. On the upper right corner of your screen, I'm going to include a link as well. So the first one is how to improve your EP, right over there. And then the next one is going to be on how to fix your skills, alright, talents, and then there's also a special one especially for dragoons only but finish this video first then you can check that out later on okay while doing this you can also do your other stuff like uh, check on your gifts just make sure that when it once it's done you can go ahead and challenge it again or go or er, go to the next dungeon dungeon right away because other party members when they say nothing is happening they immediately leave the party which is not gonna be a good thing it's gonna be a waste of your time of course waste of your time waste of their time so you should be as fast as possible when your response to this quest oh somebody already left all right so we need to send a recruit so while you're doing it you can just go ahead and send a recruit That is the reason why this is a lot better if you do it as early as the server resets because everyone have, is not yet done with your quest. For example, this one. I believe that other party member left because he or she is already done with this dungeon. It's a good thing if you already have like a uh, team or a group of friends who's uh, continuously gonna do the same thing. So this is another waste of time if somebody leaves. But uh, we've done with two dungeon quests so far, 955, so it's a good thing. There you go. So 955, we started at 945. So 10 minutes. In 10 minutes, we're done. So Povia, I think Povia have a slow date or internet connection. That's why uh, Povia is always left behind. But that's fine. He will still be or she will still be able to catch up. And uh, I also do game reviews, by the way, guys. Uh, but as of the moment, I'm playing Aura Kingdom 2 most of the time because uh, I love the gameplay of this game. And uh, that's the main reason why we're playing, right? It's about the gameplay. Graphics-wise, might not be the best, but hey, it looks good. And by the way, guys, I have another video, which is how to get orange weapon, so orange items. So watch this video as well. I'll put a uh, description on the link down below or right over there on the right over there on the upper right corner of your screen. I'm going to put it right there. Yeah, I think on my previous video somebody asked me about Vertigo trophy and I don't have a trophy yet guys, but uh, you can usually get it from doing territorial war. So make sure that you're in a good guild for you to be able to join territorial war or territory war all right guys so make sure that you also check what is the required ep 
So it's uh, 320k and let's check the EPs of our teammates. Most of us are right about 300k so that's just fine. By the way guys, I know I'm not doing it. I've been not doing it real but make sure to use the special skills of your Adelon as uh, often as possible. Watch this video up until the end for you to find out how long it uh, will take us to finish all of our quests, okay? And if you can finish it much faster than this, then don't forget to comment it down below. How much or how long do you usually finish your dungeon question? By the way, guys, in higher dungeons like like this, make sure that you dodge the boss's special skills, all right? Because you're gonna die here pre pretty easy if you're not gonna do it. So this is the part where you shouldn't be going on AFK anymore, like this one. Oh, 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 what happened? Did I get hit or something? I thought I was th my character was dying for a bit, right? See it? Oh, Belonica died. What happened? Let's finish this off. Let's finish this off, guys. Let's finish this off for Belonica. This is the last dungeon at my level, which is level 70 to 70 to 72. Back to Jen. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. We're dying, man. Come on, come on. I think I'm tanking the mobs now. Yeah, it's me. The monster is after me. All right, so we finish all the dungeons at 10:32. We finish all the dungeons, guys, at 10:32. So this will be roughly around 45 minutes, almost, right? More than 45 minutes. All right, game sir, if this video was helpful for you, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Share this video to those people who love playing Aura Kingdom 2, the mobile version. And if you have any questions, suggestions, tips, and best practices that you would love to share to us, go ahead and comment it down below. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel and ring that notification bell right over there so that you'll be notified on the latest and top mobile games today. This is Fred once again. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out to everyone and keep safe to all of you and don't forget to take it easy. Goodbye for now. See you on my next video. Goodbye now.